It's been a minute since I covered Music Bee, so here are a couple of tips and tricks you may find useful. You can increase the scale of Music Bee by changing a font. If you go to Preferences, Layout 1, Default Font, you can set the font style and size. This will apply to all text in the entire program. If a song has multiple artists, you can separate the artist by semicolon in the artist field. You can then do things like search specific artists from the search option. You can get a list of all the songs in the playlist as text. Right click the playlist, hit send to, and then clipboard. You can then paste in a text document. Only the song and artist name is copied. Unfortunately, there doesn't seem to be a way to copy other information. Music B cannot directly play videos, but it can list them in your library and playlists. If you go to Preferences, Layout 1, Arrange Panels, you can add a Navigator Panel, and in its settings, check the Video option. This will display a Video Library tab similar to the Music tab. When you play a video from Music B, it will open in your default video player. Pretty convenient. If you love your current Music B panel layout, you can export it. Go to View, Import Export, and Export Panel Arrangement. If you mess up your panel layout or reinstall Music B again, simply import the layout and never lose your panel setup. By the way, if you like my panel layout, I will provide a link. Music B can stream music from a URL. Go to File, Open Stream, and paste the URL. Music B has a robust built-in music converter. You can convert music by selecting a song, send to, format converter. Music B supports a ton of codecs, and you can adjust the encoder quality. However, Music B only comes with a handful of codecs out of the box. To unlock all codecs, you will need to download additional encoders. I've created a GitHub repository that includes every supported encoder from Music B. Simply download the zip, and put the encoders in the Music B folder under codecs. Then in Preferences, File Converters, enable the additional encoders. MusicB supports audio formats such as FLAC, AAC, ALAC, MP3, AUG, Vorbis, Opus, and more. You can remap a song location using the Organize Files function. But if you move your entire library or your music files to a different location, such as a network drive, you can remap the entire library. If you go to File, Library, Relink Music File Paths, you can map your library files. So if I moved my music library from eMusic Library to my NAS, I simply set the new path and now all my songs have been relinked. Music B has a built-in backup feature. You can use it to backup all your settings, library database files, and music files themselves. Simply provide the location where all your music is stored and Music B will copy all the files to the backup destination. You can import the settings from Edit, Save Settings, Load Settings, Snapshot. You can import library database from File, Library, Create New Library, and be sure to check the Choose Existing Library option. Then point to the library file. If you like to back up your MusicB settings with a different program, just make sure you back up the MusicB folder in Program Files and in your App Data folder. I've been using MusicB for years, and I'm still discovering features buried in this app. If you've got some tips and tricks, please do leave them in the comments. If you like my content, consider becoming a YouTube member, get early access to new content, or consider becoming a Patreon member and get access to exclusive content too hot for YouTube.